<laughs> and I'm thinking they're talking about a piece of art. No, Daryl's getting in trouble because Woo! Run, it's behind you, bro. <laughs> she just say the Renaissance area and then Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> Wait a minute, don't you beat me in the museum. Hey guys, welcome to the vlog. We are on another road trip headed to Cincinnati! I'm excited about the Cincinnati chili. I'm excited about Cincinnati chili and it is literally 95 degrees here. It's hot, but. It's 95 degrees, but and it probably feels like 100 and something you want chili. Hey, listen, <laughs> you can eat chili all year round. You hear me? Oh, it's an infinity store. We have an infinity. But currently we're stuck in a little bit of traffic, but we are about 11 minutes away. So it says, from the city, so we're gonna be <gasps> skyline chilling. <laughs> Look at that skyline chilling. So okay, we're gonna be taking you. We're gonna be taking you guys with us. It's gonna be fun, and it's just a day trip. But we said we want to vlog it and just enjoy the moment with you guys. Yes, I love to travel. I love to eat. I love to drink coffee. I love chicken. I love steaks. I love tourism. I feel deep in my heart that I am a tour guide. Not driving like this, he's not a tour guy. I've been stepping on my invisible brakes this whole trip. It is not bingo traffic. You got the Cincinnati Bengals, the Cincinnati Reds. You got the, the Cincinnati Sewers. And the sewers? Mm -hmm. Wait, are you talking about actual? What you... <laughs> Every city has sewers. I'm just. Yeah, I'm just okay, anyways, yeah, because I actually thought you were talking about some kind of team. At first, he was talking about going to see a game, but it's entirely too hot. And all and, of this, and my face would melt off right now. The Cincinnati Reds are out of town, so there's no home game, so we can't see the game anyway. Oh, okay. We're gonna show you guys pulling on my tourism hat right now. <laughs> we're gonna show you guys the historical city of Cincinnati and all the great things that it has brought to this civilization that we're living in today. Of 2023, we're gonna show you some of the historical sites, the art museums, the architecture, and the lavish landscapes. I have good memories here and I have a memory of my purse getting stolen. Yes, we were victims of identity of theft. Identity and, theft. They and we were, we had, we had came all the way home and the people who stole your purse went to McDonald's and got them a double cheeseburger. <laughs> they literally went to go get a double cheeseburger. We were tracking. How did we track them? But we seen Somehow what they we spent. Them. We seen what oh, because we saw on. what they were spending. Yeah, they bought a double cheeseburger. That was a whole crazy fiasco. They didn't even try to get a Big Mac or nothing. They went straight double cheeseburger. They got your purse stolen in Northern Kentucky. It wasn't necessarily. Okay, society. but let me flip this around so you guys flip can see. Flip the script on them. Let them see the skyline. Home of the chili. The camera's not actually capturing what it's I see. Bad, it's bad. So we're planning on going to an art museum that's here, just to check that out. They close at five, it's 3.59, so we're cutting it kind of close, but I'm hungry, I have not ate. Neither of us have ate anything, but since we're so close to them closing, we're just gonna get a snack, so. He just went into the gas station to get like a granola bar or something, and we're gonna be headed to the art museum, which should be fun. He has secured the snacks. Right. I haven't had one of these bars in forever. This is a chocolate chip energy bar. Right. I don't think that was the art museum we were at first. Oh. Look at that. Wow, look at all the steps. I'm drive. I don't know where we were. You don't know where we were? Okay, this is the right place. It is 40 mile. Turn right. And we were at the wrong location. Oh, neat, look. Isn't that neat looking? Oh, wow. 
That looks so weird. Oh. It's <gasps> okay, that was neat. That was like a play on your eyes. Yeah. We at the art museum. Ooh, this looks like it's gonna be fun. I know. That already excited me right there. Oh, look at some skaters. Now I'm getting excited. The the energy's kicking in. Thank you, Cliff Bar and water. What kind of, what kind of water is this? Wakanda. Let's oh. go. visitor guide this has a map in there to help you okay. navigate oh, okay. um, but yeah so there's antiquities on the first floor this is like um, middle oh, antiquities yeah. Islamic art. over here on this side if you go down this hallway and take a left there's Mediterranean antiquities so like okay. Egyptian Roman that kind of stuff I would usually recommend to start in one of those two ways okay. Okay. and then just make your way through the museum as you like um, okay. Okay. second Second floor has like European art, American art. Oh. First floor we have the Cincinnati wing, so it's all Cincinnati artists. Okay. Uh, yeah. That's kind of what I recommend. Yeah. 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 And if okay. You, decide you want to get tickets for the Picasso show? Just come down and check and see if they've got any. Okay. 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 Thank you. You're welcome. All right. Yeah. No went in the bathroom there's a lot of people here because they're having an event at night so I'll try to show you guys for an event they have music and food and yeah there's the star of the show I didn't know you could actually go up these steps I would have went home and missed out on the second level oh Jesus I want to see him okay the music starting okay you gonna dance Get crunk. Get crunk? Yeah. Does anybody say crunk anymore? Yeah, they used to sit there and get painted. It's, wow. This is the modern art area. Oh, that's just a hint that I need to go to Tiffany's. What do you think? Tiffany Hood. You guys, I have never seen a real painting by Picasso. Like, I say my daughter's Picasso all the time. But I've never really seen one of the paintings. This is neat just to see in real life. Okay, this is a painting. This is not a portrait. This is a painting. Guys, this person is on another level. This looks like a picture. In 1827 to 1906. Gifted, and it looks like you can literally touch the flowers. Party back. It's free.
free admission. You have to come to the Cincinnati Art Museum. Wow, look at this. So this is a very beautiful museum. If you're into like old architecture and like the Renaissance era and all of that, Abraham Lincoln, you know all that. We <laughs> should just say the Renaissance area and then Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> Wait a minute, don't you beat me in the museum? <laughs> This is from the Renaissance. <laughs> <laughs> the Renaissance. He's being a hater because this is the Renaissance era. This ain't no Renaissance. What is this? This is the hood. <laughs> <laughs> the hood. Wow. Isn't that neat? That's very interesting. Let's see. This is Yosemite Valley. Okay guys, we are going to wrap up this tour of the Cincinnati Art Museum. We are going to head downtown, get something to eat, check in, maybe check and see if the mall is still open. I know it's yeah, late. It might not be open. It better be there for some time. But, oh, we're going to head there. We need a place to stay for the night. Okay. What? That's ridiculous. It is too loud. There's not even that. Jungle Boogie. There's not even that many people here. I'm not. You're a professional vlogger. Whoa. Look at the clouds at the art museum, and God's like, "Oh, y'all want art? Oh, y'all want art? Right. I got you. I got you. Oh, you want 3D?" I got right, you. Right, we were just talking about the lighting. <laughs> this is the neatest looking sculpture I've ever seen. It is such a, oh, that's lighting up now. Look at that, like fire. Oh, wow, yeah. But guys, look at this, how it looks like. It plays a trick on your eyes. Isn't that crazy? Oh, look. What? Look. We didn't know we were standing in front of this view of the city. Oh, we're going to get down there. Okay, guys, this uh, art museum, the Cincinnati Art Museum is ginormous. I am not a thrill searcher, seeker. I'm not a thrill seeker. So, I don't do camping. And, uh, but this is not camping. This is the I don't know why I'm comparing this to camping. Well, this is a beautiful trail. I keep feeling like something's nibbling on my legs. Look at these beautiful flowers. Look, it could be the bees. We didn't tell them that they have little bee stations all around this area. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, I bet this is a pretty picture of you. Where is this trail going to take us? I don't know, but you lead the way. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> is it this way? Is it this way? <laughs> somebody, somebody help. Then help. But you know what I am thinking though? What? What is that place we didn't head to first? Because that wasn't a museum. I have no clue. And we were in the hood. We was in the hood. <laughs> so I don't H double O D. Nothing wrong with the hood, but that's where we were and we were trying to go to the museum. It's neat, look how high up we are guys. We are really high up. Can't really tell from the video, but this is a neat little path. Wow, look. Yeah, you can see down there. You can see the city. Little squirrel. It's a cute little piece of art. Look at the cube. It's a cube. Daryl. It's a cube. Daryl. You don't see the cube? <laughs> it's a cube. Let's go look at the cube. Ooh. Okay, these little, okay. Squirrels about it, about it. You hear me? I feel like I'm really in nature. Oh, this is a neat picture. Man, look at that picture up there. Where? Oh, 
Oh yeah. This Can looks you get really good. Me about a cube? Yes, hold on. She's trying to do all these uh extracurricular poses a on a 10 one. second timer. I want him to lift me up and then be looking into your eyes smiling and show you guys how it turns out. They got lights on their cube. Alright guys, on to the next adventure. Look at this. What? No, no you're not supposed to touch it. I'm not supposed to touch it outside without animals touching it. No, I got You know the animals touch it. <laughs> Squirrels jump on it. But still it's a piece of art. See, that's why he got in trouble. Y'all, let me talk about this real quick. I'm just minding my business looking at the art exhibits and I hear him talking to the security guy and I'm thinking they're talking about a piece of art. No, Daryl's getting in trouble because... Woo! <laughs> Don't run, it's behind you for real, seriously. You <laughs> got attacked by a bee. B said, Be quiet, talk about him. He had my back. And B had my back, my neck, and my back. Okay, hold on. <laughs> you said, Woo! <laughs> you guys, we still have not ate. We need food because we we just need food. And this is our we're on our third cliff bar. Did you say mini? Yes. And this tastes like it, it tastes like something done fell down the cliff <laughs> and rolled around a little bit. A chocolate dirt browning. It tastes like soil. It does. It tastes like a harvest season. <laughs> this cliff bar tastes like I need to put a seed inside and <laughs> let it grow. Something grow. But not only does it taste like it, it looks like it. Y'all look. It tastes Is like soil. It tastes like, tastes like. Hold on, y'all. Let me. Let something me. from the farmer's nice. market. Mm -mm. You said it tastes like something from where? It tastes like sod. <laughs> you said something from the farmer's market. Okay, let me taste it. I, I, okay, this is the one. I had the chocolate chip and it's in this blue pack. That wasn't too bad, but it was a slight taste of earth. Let's taste this one. Which one is this? Chocolate, Chocolate brown and brownie. dirt. Turn right. In 600 feet, turn left onto our Don't it taste drive. like fertilizer? No, actually, this one tastes better than that. Um, oh, sorry. Than the blue chocolate. Wow, this view. Look at the views. We just passed it. Uh -huh. I didn't get it's it. It's right there. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Look at that. Would you look at it? Would you look at that? The trees are blocking it, but it's a very good view. Isn't that pretty? Just look at the it. The sky is beautiful. Look at that greenhouse. The architecture is phenomenal. It's it's uh, a part of the New Age Renaissance Leviathan era. You just made that up. Yes. I don't even know. <laughs> look at this. Isn't it wonderful? It's pretty. It's very pretty. I bet if you get out, stand on the open. I'm not getting out standing on this overlook. Ooh. Oh yeah, this is this is this is a pretty view. This is a pretty route you're going. Wow. I didn't know Cincinnati was this hilly. No wonder you said this reminds you of San Francisco. We be coming around the mountain when we don't be home. We be Beautiful. Mm -hmm. You want to move over here? No, no. It's not giving I want to live here vibes. It's just giving this is nice. You hear that sound, you all? It's called sucking. Wait, wait, listen. Guys, that is my favorite. One of my favorite nature sounds. It reminds me of. Let me back this camera. It reminds me of school starting, the fall season. Hill, I gotta go up the hill. But you're like racing up the hill. The sound of cicadas? I never knew if it was <laughs> cicadas or locusts. Rattlesnakes. Anyway. Baby rattlesnakes. I, <laughs> I'm so mad because there's black on my nail. Y'all see that? Because I got this new edge control. Use the left two lanes to turn left. <gasps> I got this. Is that focusing? And oh, it's not it's not edge control. I should have uh, read it. No. <laughs> Is that brown wax? No, my edges look like I died. Look, look. 
Okay, so we're at the Kenwood Mall, and they say this is the biggest mall in Cincinnati. Are you gonna vlog? Because I don't like vlogging in the mall. I'm a professional vlogger. Okay, I don't want attention on me. Hey, look at me. Look at me, I'm filming. Oh. Look at me. <laughs> I'm the man with the cam. Okay, y'all, we're turning in here. Let's see how it looks. Ooh, it looks pretty. I'll Ooh, they have an anthropology. Nordstrom. I used to love taking anthropology in school. They got a cheesecake factory. Oh, we can eat there. No. No, last time I ate at the Cheesecake Factory, what? I think I ate too much. I'm not even gonna say it was the food, because their food's always good, but I left That's feeling kind of full. Restaurant. Oh, they have sushi. Is it sushi? Or is it sashi? What? It's like sashi. Guys, I have to take my leave. And me, and he, <laughs> are you laughing? I feel like me running from that bee. Ooh, and, some smells uh, delectable. Me needing to eat, I need to take. I'm handing the camera off, y'all. I don't even know what you're gonna get from him. Y'all already know. For, for you all, y'all gonna get that fire. You hear me? For you all that are new I'm the vlog channel, of the year. For you all that are new to my channel, this is my husband. But for those of you who have watched just a few vlogs, it doesn't take much to get his personality. And we need more of y'all to watch this channel. Yes. So we can get monetized. <laughs> ah! <laughs> that would be great to we, get monetized. We need you to watch the whole video. And then go back and watch some more. <laughs> 10, 20, 30 times. I'm surprised he's not making fun of the way I'm taking this pill. Look at it, y'all. No. Look yeah. how long it takes for it to take one little pill. Uh -huh. Look at it. Ooh, wee. That one went down smooth. Mm -mm. They want different angles. They want different perspectives. We never... need to eat. It is 6:20. You want to go into the mall first, or you want to eat first? You don't want starving like Marvin. Y'all remember that uh, starving? Who's Marvin? Why was he starving? This is the I cam. All right, y'all. We be back. Guys, Bye. Hmm? hold on, but I'm excited because we're at. Don't get my nails because I have this hair dye on them. Um, 1261 subscribers. I love y'all, I'm serious. I'm excited. Guys, I'm not completely over. Did you see that bird? What is going on? I don't like making other people uncomfortable, so I don't ever want them to think I'm trying to but vlog But the last them. time you had a camera and you was walking around, they people wanted to know they subscribed to your channel. See? That's true, but I was holding it down. I want some steak. I really want some steak. Oh, I smell that steak. Do you smell that steak? Listen, I'm a, I am a steak connoisseur. Steak and chicken. There's other, one of the other places that we go to sometimes. Yes, that's where we went for our anniversary and ate our cheesecake. And we sat outside. It was so nice. Y'all, this man right here always stops and reads directories. I feel like that's such a- You know why? Mature man move. Because we are here. I know, but who actually reads these? You do everywhere we go. We're trying to get inside. Oh, you know what I haven't had today either? What? I haven't had coffee. Oh yeah, you didn't get your coffee. Here's a look. Looks pretty in here. Oh, she's a vlog. I'm scared to vlog. I see you. The plant dad. Oh, cool. Just look at it. Take a micro course. Altered this day. I've just heard good things about it and I want to try it out. Anything for you, my love. You're going to get it for me? Anything for you, my love. My lovely husband just brought me all the gifts. Wasn't that sweet of him? Okay, you too. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. <laughs> yes, I will. <laughs> Bye. Thank you. Oh, you won't vlog. You won't vlog now, huh? So we have two ATMs. They're big.
big on community, so it's tons of local art from Columbus and Cincinnati along the walls. Okay. Each booth has a USB port as well as two outlets so that you can plug in your devices and be able to work from home if need be. We also have people that conduct interviews in the space, so these nooks are perfect for that. You know, most banks offer financial planning, but financial planning isn't good if you don't go over what your relationship is with money. So we have a lot of people from the mall that come and have lunch breaks. Maybe you bring your family. We do have puzzles that you can put together here. Mm -hmm. And then you can also reserve the space if you have a community, nonprofit, or a school organization. Wow. You get two hours. <laughs> There's ice water here that you can help yourself to. Um, it is complimentary. And then this is where you order them. And again, if you use your Capital One credit or debit card, you get 50% off. Which drink did you get? <laughs> I got an almond milk latte. Okay. Did you need, did you get any flavor? No flavor? He doesn't like any flavor because we don't do a lot of sugar. Yeah. Last year, so he has to like you know and better. Are you the manager? I am not. Okay. <laughs> do you mind telling your name? My name is Sharon. This is Sharon. Hi. So it, we are in. Where are we? What state are we in? You're in Cincinnati. We're in Cincinnati, Cincinnati. Ohio. We're in the wet mall. The Ken, we're at the Kenwood Town Center. Ken and this is the Kenwood Cafe. And she's amazing. I can't oh, believe you. whoever her manager is. She needs a raise. Oh, his <laughs> What's his name? His name is Curtis. Curtis. We love her. Okay. <laughs> Let's get your reaction. Mm -hmm. It would just be good coffee that needs just a little flavor. This beautiful lady gets to experience the ridiculousness of my husband. But he says this is top tier. We're going into... Maggiano's. 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 It's such a pretty building. Maggiano's. I'm trying to like let you guys see how this looks on the outside. Y'all, we just had the best experience in Capital One. Yeah. Best friends, you know who you are. You know who you are. I gotta get my words together because it's too much. <laughs> I'm so overwhelmed. As a concern, we have our beef tenderloin medallions, which mm. are served with uh, some portobello mushrooms if you want to keep it rolling mm. with yeah. the mushrooms. Well, I don't know what I want yet. Of course. Garlic, garlic, just as well. I think your bone in ribeye might be. So, babe. I'm hungry. So, how you like the how this place looks? Does it look Italian? It looks old timey, but like fancy something I've never been in. I feel like I'm in like an old time movie. Yeah. We in a ratatouille. That's exactly what I thought. Can't wait to get some of this olive oil on my bread, but... Listen, they have chicken parmesan Ooh. with spaghetti. Like, I don't know if I want the spaghetti. I kind of just want the chicken. Yeah. the truth and I'm trying to get my vocabulary up so that I can really <laughs> explain to you what am I tasting here's mommy I love y'all hey okay, y'all be good okay 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 well I love you so much and to and uh, tell something we love her too if she can hear me still love you mom I know it's gonna be wet, but I like to try my I like to eat my steak without any sauce on it so I can really get a yeah, idea of what the steak tastes like, the quality of the beef. This is good. Just trying to decide if it's good or not. Is it a lemony taste? So we're gonna. No, no, taste it. Uh, oh, it's eggs. It's like something. It's eggs. Egg. 
all right guys so we are back in the car the the food was the, how would you say the food was uh, i give it a seven okay uh, yeah. eight i give it an eight seven and a half you said seven and a half okay. 7.5 oh, okay he's just gonna keep going <clears throat> but my food was uh I would I, I don't I don't think I liked it that much I think because I wasn't expecting my chicken to have egg on it but I guess that's my fault for not asking about the menu in more depth but and it wasn't the chicken didn't have like egg on it it was it was it was like a boiled in egg it was like a it was like a, a yeah. egg coated piece of chicken oh you know what I think they did what I think they scrambled the egg then I oh, know they they uh they put the egg in the pan and they put the chicken on top of the egg while it was cooking. Yeah, it tasted like like an invention. Like you would just say, like, let's, <laughs> like let's just put these things together. But anyway, our the atmosphere was amazing. I liked the feel of that place because it was like an old timey feel, and there was lots of people in there. And um, the music was like the kind of music I like because I like that old timey stuff, you know. But the highlight was meeting Caitlin and Bree. Thank you guys for stopping me and asking if I had a YouTube channel. You guys really made me feel like a celebrity. Like, and you guys were so beautiful. So that was just the highlight. That was the highlight of the dinner, right? Yes. That was a highlight. Um, but this next highlight is this hotel has an art gallery in it that I'm looking at. Are you serious? <laughs> we're we're still trying to find a hotel. Like, who leaves and doesn't have their hotel? We do, but it's just part of the fun. But um, I was, what was I gonna say? We have met so many people. We're just leaving this mall. What was this mall called? Kenwood Town Center. Shout out to all of our new friends that we just met in Kenwood Town Center. It will always have a special place in our heart. Capital One crew, <laughs> y'all already know. <laughs> Y'all already know we are family. And now, what restaurant did we, did we just eat at? We ate Maginio. Maginio's Mag Little Italy Mag crew. Maginino's. You beautiful girls, we are Mag family, Mag okay? Because life is about relationships. <clears throat> Food, yeah. Shopping, yeah. But when you meet people and you get connected, that makes my heart just so happy. Yes. We happy. Okay, <laughs> I'm so glad we decided to come here because it really made the trip, just meeting everybody. So now I guess we need somewhere to sleep. And so we're gonna get in a hotel. Unless you wanna go see the movies. You wanna go see the movies? I don't know, what you wanna do? I don't know. Okay, so this is the hotel we are maybe staying at. What's the name of this one? It's called, uh, uh, what? The summit? The summit. Look how cool this is. What does that say? Uh, NFT, the name of the hotel. And it's an art gallery. This trip was meant for us to see art. Right, babe? This hotel's not called NFT. NFT is a, it's called Summit. <laughs> this oh, oops. NFT this hotel is called The Summit. NFT is what? NFT is a, uh, it's almost like, it's like a digital trading platform. Oh. This is cool. The haircut? What is that? Oh, people submit how his hair should be cut. Like, those are drawings. What? 
This is the coolest hotel ever. Look at these seats. And look at that. Oh, the kids would love it here. Oh, it's see through. I love these. Okay, I'm looking down. Uh, hotel that we stay in, yeah. But this is not in artsy and yeah. modern. It goes up again, like you can take steps. Yeah. Fitness in it? This way? Where do we go? Our rooms on this? Oh, look, there's the rooms. Oh, look at that! Look at that! Come on, let's go over here real quick. Look at the light, at the light. Oh, this is steps to go up. So we could have went up these steps. Y'all, yeah. look at this. Look at look look at the architecture. This is so cool. And these were the steps. Okay. Oh, look at this piece of art. This is the artsiest trip we've ever been on, and I'm loving it. Oh. This one? This one? <laughs> Guys, you're getting a live tour. Well, actually, you're not, because we've left once this vlog has been posted, but you're seeing this for the first time with us, and this is amazing. This is us? Look how neat the room is. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh. <laughs> Look, I, don't, I can't even see anything. Else. <laughs> Whoa. Nice. The red wall is cool. Okay, it has like a really big mirror right here. This is cool. Oh, this is nice. Does it get any lighter? Yeah. Cue the music. Room tour. to this super cool hotel. Y'all, I'm literally holding this light. Lighting, see this is the difference. Look, without, with. There you go. But look, I already got it. Look, see. No, it, it looks harsh. It go. looks harsh? And you know, you have it, you want manual focus. Okay, let's, hold on. I'll be back, guys. It's pretty late, but we, it's not too late, right? What? This has been such a fun trip. It feels like we have been here for days. And we literally got here this morning. Doesn't it feel like that, babe? Yeah, we, we got here around 2 o'clock. I know. We left the house at... Late. 12 like, we didn't even leave early. Yeah, we, like, left, like, midday. But this is such a cool experience. I love these mini trips with you. I'm going to go that up. We're going to do a taste. Are we gonna do the, when do you want to do the taste thing? Daryl went somewhere, and they had these... Candies that were um, it was in Missouri. In Missouri, and they had gummy flavored nerds. Yes, their gummies. Their gummies covered with nerds, yes. and we're gonna do a, a live taste test. What um, are you making? Coffee. Oh, he's over there making more coffee. How many cups of coffee is that? 
Well, we're gonna come back over here and we're gonna do this live taste test because I've never tasted them. He said they're really good. This is a vibe. This is a vibe. No, yeah, it literally is. It's a whole vibe. Uh oh, the battery's getting ready to die. Let me change it out real quick. All right, guys, this whole place is a vibe. I like, how, my, how many times am I gonna say that? But, um, so, while we're waiting on him to get his coffee and stuff together, I, I wanna show you guys what I got from Sephora. And so, what I went in there and really wanted was the Summer Fridays Lip Butter Balm. And um, so, I got two colors. I, I have the color um, let me find it. Vanilla beige, that like this. And I got the color brown sugar. I couldn't pick which one, and Daryl was like, just get both. And I said, okay, I'm gonna try on the vanilla beige. Y'all, excuse my nails, I'm gonna do them here in the hotel because like I've said, I've. <laughs> Did I say this in the vlog? This really dyed my hair. And my thumbs. Okay, now that we have that out of the way, we're gonna go in the bathroom because you guys, I want you to see the color, the true color. Y'all, this bathroom, look at the wallpaper. Okay, I'm gonna prop you guys right here on top of the tissue box. there was like black on my face it's the dye it's transferable <laughs> tissue do you see that it's got on my nails and my face and everything okay guys it's the end of the day so, so this is what it looks like this is the vanilla beige and let's try it on I'm gonna actually make a short okay. so I <laughs> So I got the Summer Fridays Vanilla Beige, and let's try it on. I like that it has like this, the way they made the nozzle, it follows your lips. It's hard to explain, but yeah. This is the color. Oh, that's so cute. Babe. Oh. That's fire. It looks like my tone, but just like a, yeah. like it was hyped up. Because it is $24 for this size. You paid $24 for that? Yeah, did you know that? Hey, listen, it ain't nothing. It ain't nothing for my wife. Enjoy life. And he makes it very enjoyable. So that's that one. I don't even want to wipe it off. Let's try out the brown sugar. And we're gonna open it. And guys, these are, these Summer Friday lip glosses are vegan. I love that so much. This is what the packaging looks like on the brown sugar. Oh, it feels so good on your lips. Ooh, that one's pretty too. Y'all, these glosses are worth the hype. This is the brown sugar. Daryl! This is the brown sugar. Ooh, both of them is fine. Which one do you like the, the best? I don't know. This one has like a, a a more of a like a pinkish tone. I like that. Oh, we need this in the house, don't we? I know. Up close and personal. Which one's your favorite? I don't. And can you imagine this with like a lip liner, too? Mm-hmm. I'll wear one tomorrow, and I'll be able to tell you guys how long they last. But this is pretty. Thank you, babe. He's the best. All right. Let's do this taste test. Okay, guys, one more thing before the taste test. I got one more thing from Sephora. This is the Brazilian Crush Charosa. I have the one, the number 40. It's the Black Amber Plum and Vanilla Woods. 
Smells so good. What is that perfume I have? Do you remember the name of it? Seven, seven virtues. virtues. Yep. I have the seven virtue. Well, I had the seven virtues perfume and that I used it all up, but it lasted me a good year. Cause I got it on our last anniversary. So it lasted me like a year. Um, this reminds me of it. This one right here. It's, it worked. It's a spray perfumado. <laughs> I don't care. You said perfume. <laughs> perfume. Okay, so the fragrance notes in this are black amber plum, jasmine blooms, and vanilla woods. And this is, is this vegan? No, I don't think this is vegan. I don't know. I don't think so. But it is the perfect fall scent. I'm not necessarily like a seasonal perfume kind of girl. Like I will wear any perfume that I like, but I do feel like there are certain ones that are like day and night. So I would say this is more of a, if you if you are someone that does that, this, is, this isn't really fruity. So I guess you would say this is more of a fall scent because of the darker plum and vanilla wood. I do not know how to describe perfumes. That's just not my lane of expertise. So. I already sprayed this on earlier, but I was like out and about, so I really want to get like a fresh. Mmm. Now you can like, my vanilla woods, you didn't really sm smell any fruit, but you can smell the plum in this. Yeah. What does that smell like to you? Does it smell like fall? It smells like, you know what it smells like in between summer and fall. Yeah, I wouldn't even say it smells like fall. Yeah, it feels like this is a perfect anytime you want to wear it. Yeah, it's like a, it's like a it's like a year round scent. Yeah. So that's all I got from Sephora. But now, dun dun dun. This is what we're this is what we're gonna be trying out. These are the I'll let, I'll let. Get out the way, move. I wish they had two chairs. Ooh, yes. Look how low I am. Peace. Hey! There you go. Okay, guys. I was in Joplin, Missouri. Okay. Backstory. And someone had these out in a bowl. They had, a, I mean, they had like a thousand of them in a bowl. Mm -hmm. I was like, what are these? And it was like, oh, taste the rainbow. And let me tell you that he is not a candy person. I like candy. Like, he doesn't eat a lot of sweets. So when he even told me about these, I, I was the like, the only candy I eat is gummy bears. And these. Tell my business, I'm in the streets. All right, listen, listen. I don't know if you can see, but can, can you see that? Let me take one out, Sean. Hold on, let me show them this. Let me show, no, I'm okay. They, they gotta look in the bag, look at that. Oh yeah. Look at that. All right. We should take our thumbnail picture. Let's take a thumbnail. Oh, oh, mm. I wonder if it's really that good. Mm. Mm. Something about me is I'm not, Daryl, I'm not really, okay. He always just takes it to another level. I, I'm, I'm not, like, not really a fruit person, but I did like nerds. That was like the only candy that I liked that was not chocolate, so. You dropped one. Here I go. You gotta chew it, you gotta keep chewing it cause you gotta let it hit, you gotta let it. Got that merchandise in your palate. Mm. See, you got that take it back to mm -hmm. elementary. It takes you back to elementary. It does. Mm. I'm on the playground right now. Somebody push me. Yeah, that's good. Off the playground. Swing. Man, yeah, I'm that back. was good. It, mm. it actually tasted like how I thought it would taste. Mm. Cause when you explained it before, I was kind of imagining it. And it mm. But the only thing that surprises me is how Tart it is immediately. You didn't tell me it was like tart. Cause it's a nerd. It's a real deal nerd. But all nerds aren't tart. Yes, they are. Funny story. I used to say tarty. This is so tarty. It smells like. Do you mean tart? Mmm. <sighs> it hits you right. Mmm. It's like a tart. You like? It hits you. And really yeah. You. I don't really like the sour. T it's not sour, but. Very berry nerds surround fruity gummy centers. Those sweet little sparks are fantastic inventors. A poppable cluster packed with tangy. Yes, tangy. That's what it is. 
That's the exact word I was looking for. Tangy, crunchy nerds. Wait. A candy so tasty, there aren't even words. Was, is that how you were describing yes, it? Yes, give me the nerds. This, okay. So this is a once. I'm probably gonna eat this. He does not eat like this. This is probably gonna be the last time I eat this. Any of this this year. You know, eat yeah. more. I told them like mm. a lot of times on the vlogs you see like food that we don't even normally eat. When we vlog, we're like excited eating foods that we don't. But we eat healthy 99% of the time. Like we have changed our eating. So this right here is definitely a treat. Just for being on this one day trip. Oh, it's a big treat. You Huge. hear me? Yeah. Mm. You want to look at that documentary or something? something Do you guys cool. like documentaries? Because we that's our thing. I love learning about people or situations that I didn't know anything about. Yeah. I think that's very interesting. I love overcomers. Because we have overcome by the blood You're of like the really land. close to them. I am? Uh -huh. You're I like talking like... I want them to... Okay. Ooh, these are addicting. Yeah. Okay. My wife is all about beauty, and I'm all about steaks and chicken and candies. Okay. I really thought you was gonna say something deep, and that was so not deep at all. Hey, no, no. I wish you guys were here so you can taste this, but you're not. So this is the best we can do. Goodbye. Y'all. He said this was his last time dipping in the bag. Oh, so light. Look what happened. <coughs> and I told him. No, get away. I said. Get away. That, this was supposed to be the end of the vlog for the night, but I had to turn the camera back on. Get for this. away. Look, I said if it landed like that, we didn't need any more, and it was a sign. Guys, it is upside down. There's, they're gone, babe. They're gone. <laughs> Look, I can't even save any. They all dropped. <laughs> Why? Why? Okay, we need to go back to the movie. Morning, guys. Well, this is our last day. Well, it was a day trip. So this is the next morning. <laughs> And we are checking out, uh, why are you making that face? Cause you always trying to kick me out on the days and the next days you always trying to do day trips and you don't do nowhere. That is not even the truth. Anyways, so we, are get, we have to get out of here because check out, we already got a late check out. I was like, and so, excuse me, can I have a, a, a late check out? They was like, check out is at 11, so the most we can give you is till 11 or one. No, I didn't no, say 11 or one, I said 11 30. So. I didn't even get to do my makeup. So I guess I'll be doing it in the car. She didn't get to do her beat. This has been such a nice room. This room is... Let me show you. We already showed him the tour. <laughs> but they didn't get to see it in the daylight. Look at that big old window. I want to take, take a picture in this mirror. Wouldn't it be cute to be like... All right. Okay, so my friend Sharon just text me um well she th she told us about it last night a good re uh breakfast place to go to so we're excited we're gonna check that place out
All right, guys, so I just did a quick makeup look in the car, um, and we just got to the Cincinnati, Ohio Mom and Them Coffee. Is it a coffee shop? Well, we just got here, and we're gonna try out the breakfast. We're excited. Yeah. I'm normally not even a breakfast person, but this morning I'm hungry, so I'm excited. Let's go. Let's go. back in the car we decided to eat in the car on the way home yeah. we think home um and here's Ooh. the sandwich you guys it's the bacon and the uh and the olioli avioli whatever the oli is it looks avocado. good mm, look at that sandwich oh avocado's dropping here we go <laughs> excuse me how is it Wow, and this place is so cute too. Mm. Oh, look at them taking a selfie. Mm. It's, it's my turn. Oh my gosh, I haven't tasted it. This is like the perfectly cooked English muffin. I ain't never had an English muffin so crispity. Mine looks just as delicious. Mmm. Mmm. This is a fire. Here I go. It's the best combination of flavors. So driving through Cincinnati, me and my husband were just talking about how life is all about perspective. Once I got into the city and started exploring the city, we started exploring and going different places and like not just shutting your mind off immediately, like opening up your mind to like new places and new areas. We have loved it, right? Right, and you know what? I'm gonna be honest with you. Hopefully I don't have crumbs on my face, y'all just ate. I think Google has changed a lot of how people travel because now you can you can search things by rating and by like. So we was able to find some really cool places and in those places It's when we met cool people. We met cool people and then in cool surroundings. We're like, wait a minute, I didn't know this was And then they re and then they recommended places and then it's like all yeah. about opening up, up your mind. And we Googled the mall mm -hmm. and we went to the mall and we found some Cool, super cool people. Met with some cool, super cool people. Drunk some really good coffee. And the, because we Googled the mall, then we had a we went to a restaurant. Was really cool. And then I Googled the hotel we were in. Like I would never have found these places if I would just stayed on the surface of Cincinnati. Like oh, let's just stay downtown. Right. And I don't even know. We told the name. The name of the hotel we stayed in was the Sum. The, the summit. summit. Yeah. And uh, super, that's like the best hotel I ever stayed in my life. Yeah. You hear me? It just like that's yeah but it just taught us something even we were talking about places but then we were like that's the same with people god has so many of his people everywhere yeah so many different people from different backgrounds everywhere and you can't look on the outside either of a person you can't look at somebody and be like oh they look like they're not going to be approachable yeah or oh they don't look like you know somebody that would be I even like if I look if I seen you from the on the outside if I'm looking at you I'm like oh she's just you know a makeup person she just she thinks she's cute what she just thinks she's stylish okay but then you would think that I mean if I looked at you from the surface I'm like oh she's super no she's I'm not like, like that at all she's super oh yeah she look good oh she's the bomb oh he's yeah, trying, yeah yeah he's trying to fix it up uh no you would say that you'd be like but I bet she ain't say but then you go talk to you and then you slap somebody with the in Jesus name Holy Spirit Come yes down I will the scriptures. Ah! I love I love I but love people, Jesus. Were, people don't expect that. Like when the girl asked you, she said, "You said, oh yeah, if you like makeup and you love Jesus." She was like, mm -hmm. yes. 
you yeah that's one thing about me i love people i love jesus i love people and i love like makeup and fashion yeah and all so that, like when people but, see me they're like oh he's handsome he's big he's buff okay oh anyway can I get, like my point is <laughs> And then there's people that you see and you immediately like connect with. Like there's something about them, like Sharon. Like when I met her, I, it was like her spirit was so bright. Sharon, I was like drawn Sharon. to her. Yeah, like a magnet. And she recommended the food place, and that's how we met. We went to uh, the Mama's. What was it? Mama, Mama and Nim's restaurant. That's where we just left, showing you guys. And we didn't realize that we were talking. Daryl was talking to the Mama. owner founder yeah because when we went outside in the cash register yeah work don't that teach you like humility too yeah i have been taught so many lessons like yeah she was working on five and it's just one man god has just a way of showing you all kind of lessons in life and letting you experience goodness like god wants you to experience the good life he wants you to enjoy life and that's what we're doing where are we going uh we're yeah. going to my favorite camera shop in this region it's called pro cam oh yes uh camera gear and all that stuff like that because i am a videographer yes he is and uh, i'm going to check some things out yeah and then after that we'll be headed home to our babies oh we are at my favorite camera store in cincinnati pro cam baby baby and I'm just gonna go check out some cool gear. Look at that. Would you look at it? Just look at it. Just look at it. Hey, look at that crazy man over there. I feel like you have so many of these. They all look alike. I don't know what you use each of them for. Yeah, I have this one. Isn't that what I have? This is my go to Oh, yeah, yeah. That's, that's this is mine. I know, I said that, that looks familiar. Ooh, look. <gasps> this has a mirror in it? You can attach a mirror to it. Should you attach a mirror to it? No, this is where you can put your camera in. This is for phones. Oh, well, that's neat. What like, is it? Huge flash. Like... You guys, this is Daryl and his element. This, this is Daryl. Right here. All this. Stuff I am just now starting to understand. So I guess this is me too. I've entered this world. Right? This is my life now. <laughs> All right. So... Went into the camera store. Let's see what I got. I got my wife and I. Oh, this is for me too. A flash, a, a larger flash store so we can do some very powerful photography. Because mm -hmm. look at her face. Look at his face. Look at your face. Look at his face. I get, oh, I got a soft box, a smaller soft box so that way we can film in tight places. What else did we get? <laughs> oh, and I got her a camera bag so she can hold her camera and she can put her, look at this, you can see this, look. What? Look at this. Oh, what is that? This is for when, if it's raining outside. Shut up, you I, hear me? That's cool, I didn't know that was on there. <laughs> so you can put your batteries and then she lifted up here. Check this out, guys. Why are you being so heavy-handed? Because it's made for that. This is tough stuff. I'm trying to go fast over again. So she can put her SD cards in here. This was a great idea because we need SD yeah, cards. Uh, camera strap. So, and this is large. Oh, enough. hold on. Wait a minute. This is the most. This is the most oh. important part. Oh, that's the most important part. This part right here, I can put my lip gloss. <laughs> She was in there talking to the camera store sales rep, and he was talking about his wife and her lip glosses. And they was on Amazon looking at lip gloss pouches I it was and so holes. so cute. He pulled up 
he showed me on Amazon the pouch that his wife uses to hold her lip gloss on the go. Isn't that cute? The fact that he even knew that about her, I thought that was sweet. I was like, hold on, buddy. This is a camera story. Don't be talking about makeup. We we go to Sephora. We go to Alta. We talk about makeup. We in a camera shop. Talk to me about some digital products. Some photography. Some lights. Cameras. Actions. You talking about lip gloss. I won't be back at that store. No time today. Yeah. Now, I just left Walgreens. Got our on the road trip. I got me some Perry Air. If I watch these vlogs, I'll be like, they eat so much junk, and we don't. We only eat for y'all. When we're not vlogging, we don't eat. That's so true that at we home fast. we don't. We, I mean, we do eat, but we eat like very healthy. We don't eat like lots of candy. Do I have to eat? Oh, and we don't, we don't eat like. Whew. If you know us, we don't drink soda. No. We don't I only drink, drink water, that's it. Sparkling water. Nothing is, else. Is what we do. Yeah, if you ever see us in a restaurant with a and drink. And because we don't drink this. sugary drinks, I can taste every bit of lime that they squeeze in here. Let me see if I can. Oh, taste it. Taste that lime. You can taste the lime. Oh, it's sparkly. That's like a that's like a This isn't my favorite one though. My favorite sparkling drink is bubbly. I don't know what it is. Oh, we got some of those in the trunk. Yeah. Sparkling water is not good at room temp. And sparkling water is good for you, but we found out like it's not good for your uh, weight or appearance because it makes you look bloated. So, yeah. But but we but, was drinking so much soda water, we was getting... We felt like we were ballooned. so skinny after we stopped. Mm -hmm. We were just full of carbonation. <laughs> but we drink more regular water now. Yeah, I only drink... Water. I don't actually even drink sparkling water anymore. Where's your, hardly ever. Where's your big... Your big goat. Oh, I didn't bring it. I didn't bring it because I knew I'd she get a lot of water. She has a big water. jug. I watched I'm so proud of her because look at her skin mm -hmm. and her hair is growing. Okay. And her skin, skin glowing, hair growing. You hear me? But we wanted to hop on here and close out this vlog because it's been so much fun. We're on the way home. We're just gonna hit the road. I'm Bye. Gonna, I'm gonna. Wait a minute. Oh. I'll, no. I was just gonna say, I'm gonna hurry up and edit this so we can watch it. Okay, bye. Bye.